Well, now I just hit the start recording button. Thank goodness. So for uh, for the YouTubers, we have Brown on Diddy Kong and Len. He was just here a game or two ago. Um, thank goodness you guys did miss it. Um, I got bodied by Rags' Bayonetta 2-0. Like how I said I would. But. Anyways, back to this game, though. See, um, Brown is doing a pretty good job of uh, spacing out. Oh my gosh, Len. So he's very well versed in his Diddy Kong. And I commend him for that. Trying to stay neutral, though. I uh, do like how Len is playing pretty well around not the forward smash, but everything else before that. Because he was pretty even a percent, was it? Low 70s to low 90s. But um, it seems he is going to be able to bring it back if he can get something started. I would assume. If you are using a pro controller, please disconnect it. Your control stick is making one of the settings back here unusable. Uh-oh. Uh, pro controller problems. But as I was looking away, it seems Brown was able to nearly lap Lennon percentage. I mean, 109 to 85 is pretty, pretty interesting. Not as interesting as that stock, though. Let's see what banana, uh, Brown Man can do with this banana. I say Brown Man, that's a different person entirely. Now, it looks like he is trying to go for... Ooh, that shield, though. Hopefully he gets the uh, down tilt to up smash. It looks like that's what he's going for. Now, banana is living for so long just the throwbacks back and forth oh i'm getting a friend what is up ladies and gentlemen this is Isan coming at you live here from mason's match we've got a match coming up here all righty oh it looks like the back throw almost taking out the character there lucina definitely on her last legs here Oh, the down oh. smash is going to seal things out. Nice stuff from Brown. Sweeped out by Diddy Kong's legs. How about that? Absolutely. And, and, you know, Brown's doing very solid here. Sig, definitely one of the higher-seeded players around here. Uh, not necessarily going his main, but still working very well in Brown's favor there. Is that Sig or is that Len? This that is be Sig, Len, yes? I believe. Oh, well, I'm pretty sure. No, that is Len. I, Len, I'm oh. sorry. I still can't tell the difference. Okay. You're right. That is Len. Okay. <laughs> well... Oh, Good. and it looks like Len is going to be player, switching. I'm glad to see Fox, but I'm leaving <laughs> again. Alrighty. Goodbye, well, friends. Okay, so we are going to see Len switching to the Fox here. Already putting him in deep in pressure. Oh, my God. you got to run it through. You're committed at that point. Absolutely. There's another jab there. Okay, both these guys going back and forth. And joining me on the mic is Albin Nora. What's up, Albie? Not much. Just uh, playing some video game. Awesome. Well, uh, we've got Brown up one over Len here. And... Uh, Wait, Brown's up? Yes. Brown is up. And, uh, okay, getting back into it. And it looks like Brown is already in a tight spot. Len has gotten so much damage on this Diddy Kong, and uh, he's keeping Ooh. him off stage very easily here. Ooh, Ooh and there's the smash. smash. Could, and that will take the first stock. Nice stuff from Len there. Absolutely doing a wonderful job of making sure that Brown cannot recover, keeping that advantage state at all times. And it looks like we're going right into those jabs, just like before. Monkey kick just to get oh. to the center of the stage. Absolutely. Catching him with the dash attack. Follows up immediately into the jab there. Nice catch on the DI. Tries to go for the down air, but he is going to get stopped out by the fair. Oh, okay. Now Brown is stuck on this platform here. Absolutely. Well, that's Ooh. not a bad spot for him to be, to be honest. It lets him pull the banana, get his uh, item back, and chill for a bit. That said, he is in a lot of trouble here. He's already getting juggled super hard by Lens Fox. But at the same time, he is getting rage, so that would make him killing Fox much easier. That is true, but he is on his last stock. He's going to have to be very cautious and not get back here. <laughs> Len going to take game two here. And uh, both these guys down to one more game. Okay, the reason I asked why Brown was up because... I don't know how to do that. What? I don't know how to... 
Oh. All righty. And we are one game away, and it looks like uh, Len taking things a little more seriously here. Drop the Lucina, and the Fox is putting in work already. We're yeah, seeing the like dividends. Going, yeah, it looks like we're going to Town City for our final game. Absolutely. I don't know how much I agree with this, to be honest. Len has been doing an awesome job of juggling Brown and uh, catching him with these up airs. So to be on a stage like Town and City, where he could die off the top way easier, it's going to be real dangerous for him. Yes, but well that could be said to go in both ways because Diddy does have some pretty high-reaching combos. Ooh, he needs to start hitting some buttons out of that. Alrighty. Okay, some fancy movement from Brown, but he's going to have to find a way back to stage. Gets caught by the jab, and Len is running away with this right now, Albie. Ooh. Benny gets the trip, so he doesn't get much off that. Absolutely. Excellent spot dodge here on Ooh. the uh, down smash. Going to immediately follow up with the grab into the up smash. Nice stuff from Len. Ooh! Ooh catches the monkey flip with the up smash, and that will already be Brown's first stock. That is some really solid conditioning from Len here. He noticed that uh, Brown really likes to recover high, especially with that monkey flip, because he can use those active hitboxes to get back to stage, get center stage easier. So Len catches onto that and finishes off the stock very quickly. And Ari doing a quick 40% right here. Ooh. Oh, no. You got to be careful with those monkey flips. One missed space hit, and uh, already Brown is in a lot of trouble. Ooh. Okay. I like that. He's using jabs to kind of check his shield a bit, see what Brown's up to. <laughs> now, normally in this situation is when we'd start seeing Fox go for a lot of grabs. He knows that his opponent's going to shield because they're scared of the confirms. So he can use those grabs to get that corner and, pressure. Uh, unless they just SD. <laughs> <laughs> very unfortunate SD. Right. Hey, you just click this. Len going to take it. 2-1 over Brown. Nice stuff from Len there. Dirty. 